Well, James, you're back in the Betfred Super League Grand Final, and it's kind of written in the stars, wasn't it? It was going to be St Helens for you. Uh, yeah, it's been the team I'd want to play, my old one, and uh, I'm buzzing to be here, and obviously to be playing them makes it a bit special. A boyard Leeds fan, of course. How special is it going to be for you walking out here in those colours? Uh, yeah, it won't get better than that, obviously. Uh, I got to play in one with Saints, but obviously to play from the Boyle team makes it a bit more special. An opportunity to write your own history in the Leeds shirt, but what do you remember about some of those famous grand finals over the years, watching them growing up? Uh, yeah, watching the likes of Sydney lift that trophy many a time has been some of the best times as a kid when you sat out here watching them and cheering and that, but um, I'm looking forward to getting out there and playing and hopefully writing a bit of my own history. We all know the history of Leeds doing it from fifth, but when you look at the journey your team has been on this year, the form you're in coming into this, it doesn't really feel like first versus fifth pitch, does it? Uh, no, when, when we were sat at 11th as well at one point, it was uh, you'd never thought we'd get here, but um, we've picked up some good form and we've got confident playing together and we've managed to knock them wins off and we're feeling confident coming into this game too. Your personal form has been really strong coming into this game as well. How much of that is due to the kind of the atmosphere and the players around you, but also the, the impact of Rowan? Uh, yeah, Rowan's been massive for me. Um, helped me strip my game back a lot and uh, I wasn't really happy with how we were playing and that was showing and now I'm enjoying my rugby and I'm happy and I think it shows. Uh, grand finals are obviously always special. From your experiences of them, are they different games in terms of what happens on the pitch as well? Um, yeah, the, the, the fly-by, um, it felt like two minutes, that one that I played in in 2020. Um, and I'm just to keep on telling all the lads, you've got to take these moments and enjoy it because before you know a blink of eye, it'll be over. Obviously, that, that 2020 one was, was very different, played behind closed doors at Hull. The, the atmosphere is going to be electric here at six o'clock on Saturday. You must be relishing getting out in the middle of that. Yeah, I can't, I can't wait. Um, I remember being sat here on the sideline last year and uh, it was absolutely booming in here and I was absolutely gutted that I couldn't play because of injury and thankfully I've got the opportunity to come back this year and I can't wait to run out of the tunnel and see that end full of Leeds fans. Well, best of luck and enjoy it. No, it's cheers. Thanks.